Okay, ladies, even though it's Labor Day and we're thinking about barbecues and food, we still need to think about our heart health. Heart disease is the leading cause of death for women just 35 years old and over. It's six times more deadly than breast cancer. Symptoms often go unrecognized and untreated in women. This information comes from our friends at Deborah Heart and Lung Center. To learn more, just check out the Women's Heart Center at Deborah. We have a link on our website, cbsphilly.com. Click on Talk Philly. And right now, we're here with a heart-healthy recipe. Chef Walter <laughs> Stave of City Tavern. He's the chef ambassador for Deborah Heart and Lung Center. And chef, this is looking good. What do you have for us today, I'm going to show you really quick uh, two things. I'm um, doing a roti with crab meat, but I'm going to show you really quick how to do the most fantastic pineapple relish you ever had. So all, right. all, all I do is I put some cilantro, I put some chili pepper. Okay, put, no, when I buy cilantro, it doesn't come in a tube. What, what's this? That's what I'm trying to tell you. Yeah. <laughs> because that is the best thing you can do, the, the amount of labor it saves. There's 21 uh, ginger in there. The lemongrass, look how difficult it is. You get a piece of lemongrass like this. You gotta dice it up. You gotta dice it up. You gotta know where to dice it. Or you get, you get a lemongrass like, like I'm doing here. I like a challenge. I think I'm gonna work with this. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> All the bone acts up. You can just, you know. And, then, right. and, then, <laughs> look, and, and, and this is done. Then you want to get a really good rice wine vinegar, the best you can buy, an organic one. Okay. Put a rice vinegar into it. You put a little bit of uh, white pepper into it, white pepper. Okay. And then red onions. And the oh. pineapple, I just chop it, cut into little sticks like so. All right. And throw it all together. And you know what? When you mix that up good and you work very clean, that can last in your refrigerator literally for like two months. Two months. Because mm -hmm. the vinegar kind of acts as a preservative. Now, if you like more heat, less heat, then it depends how much more pepper you put into it, like habanero okay. peppers okay. or any kind of peppers like it. But just to take a whiff of that, the, no, flavor, the, the flavor of the, the thing. The rice vinegar really yep. smells You're great. a big fan of that rice vinegar, aren't you? Because it, anytime I use food, I use rice wine vinegar. It just kind of blends together very well. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, <clears throat> now, I take a wrap. This happens to be a whole wheat wrap with carve seed. And carvey seed is fantastic for this dish we make. And so all you put there is some mango chutney. Okay. Any kind of chutney, may I grace. Put some chutney on the bottom. Now this one here I cooked. It's basically coconut milk. The recipe is on the website. Okay. Right. Coconut milk, garlic, onion, potatoes, yukon goals, and then last moment the crab meat into it. Okay. And oh, a little bit of seasoning. Oh, mm -hmm. I love some crab meat. And then, then all you gotta do is, you see the crab meat right there? Oh, yes. Really beautiful lamb crab. Take a look. Nice. Now, should you buy the fresh stuff or is the canned okay? The canned is very good for that. Okay. And the thing over this, I would no salt for the burra because we're gonna keep it salt free. Okay. And all you do is take it like so, roll it in like a giant burrito, and you're in business in two seconds. And then that all you gotta do delicious. is... Uh, and then Cut you put up. the salsa on top of there? The, the I serve it on the side, but okay. you can also put it on top. But this one has your name on it right over here. This one does? Yeah. Oh, there you go. Oh, and this has your name on it. Here. Oh, thank you. Do you mind if I use my hands? No, you're supposed to. Here you go. Okay, okay thank know. you. Go ahead, just bite into it. Oh, use the fork? <laughs> no, a fork. Oh, crazy. Now, I'd never think to put chutney with a curry. The is, best. That a, is that a common flavor? Mm -hmm. And the combination, of that, the combination of those flavors. Mm. That is delicious. And this is like what they serve on the streets in many of the islands, Jamaica, St. Yeah. Lucia. It's a different adaptation. It's very healthy because look here, there's no fat at all. You notice mm -hmm. that? Right, right. Just mm -hmm. a little bit of the coconut milk, but that's why you're uh, the ambassador. Try it. <laughs> and Deborah, Deborah had long said it makes it happen. We work so closely with the nutritionist to always bring new ideas to the table, but but delicious. Isn't it good? And so, just a quick question: yeah. What's the difference between chutney and just other jams and stuff out there? Well, it's what just a mango. It's really there's many chutneys. You can okay. do peach chutney, cherry chutney. Chutney just means it's preserved down. You cook it down. Okay. And it's all of this. I always wondered that. Yeah. Thank and this you. one happens to be a good one, Mayor Gray, but there's many different ones. The trick to this whole thing, though, as I said, if you make it and you want to keep it in your refrigerator, work very clean, use a very good, like the macaron rice wine vinegar, mm -hmm. and it sits up for a long time. Isn't it delicious, though? Sure. It is. Great Give it up. Thank Bang. You. For right. you, for you. Mm, for you. Chef's mm. Chicken Curry Rote with sweet and spicy pineapple salsa. Salsa, I love saying mm. that. And today, to we, today we're doing the crab meat. And the crab, crab meat. Yeah. Go today. to cbsphilly.com, <laughs> click on Talk Philly. It's delicious. We'll be right back. Mm, mm. Yum.